Hello, my YouTube friends and my subscribers. Thank you so much for coming back. If you're new, thank you so much for watching. This is part two for my basement renovation. I know that this room looks a little bit dark, but that's exactly how my husband wanted it. This is part of his man cave. And if you want to see part one, please go to my channel to see exactly how we renew this entire room from the bare bones due to um, flooding in the basement. So I wanna show you the uh, this wood planks that we put on the wall to make a frame for our projector screen. And this is a small closet where he's putting all of his gadgets, all of his electric electronic devices. And over to the right is our sub pump for our basement. I recommend even if you're not having any um, flood issues or any moisture issues, always have a sub pump in your basement. You just never know, okay? So I love this because he, he actually put the wood planks on the counter behind the first couch. And that first couch is actually on an, um, what do you want to call it? It's it's set up so that way it could have that movie-like feel. So it's on a, a different platform. There you are. We also have a little area where we have storage. So if you look in here as well, this is another sub pump for our plumbing system, but we're also using it for storage. Use every bit of place, nook, nook and cranny to for storage. So that way you can kind of put away things that you don't want to see because it's an eyesore. What I also like is that he is using a theme in this room. So it's an African theme, he is Nigerian. So he kind of went back to his roots. I don't know if you could see the bottom there, but there are several different vases that um, are African themed. And over to the left, um, there is a picture, um, that decorative picture of, a, of an African theme as well. He also incorporated lights in this room. And I know that's a little, you know, preschoolers, elementary, childish, if you will. But we do have two kids and we do have movie night in here. So he's put the lights over at the bottom of the counter and at the back of it as well. And he also added a little pleasant surprise where he's placed the lights on the ceiling. So I'm gonna show you that as well. So I've turned the lights off so you can see the dramatic effect of it because I think it's pretty cool. And you can also change the color of the light. So right now it's on blue, but you can change it to white, yellow, green, purple, and